Wanna know something? Self-adhesive cellulose tape and Sustainable Development Goals, or SDGs, a topic much talked about recently, have an unexpected connection. Let's look closely at the secret behind this. In Anjo City, Aichi Prefecture, Japan, lie the secrets of this tape. To begin with, how is self-adhesive cellulose tape manufactured? First, you stretch out natural rubber with a gigantic roller to make it soft. Then you add resin. Stir until it is all dissolved to make it a pressure-sensitive adhesive. Another material is cellophane film. There are three important processes. First, you apply primer. Then you apply a release agent. Finally, you apply the pressure-sensitive adhesive we saw previously. Now please pay attention here. Natural rubber is of course an all-natural product, but cellophane film is a natural product as well, which makes self-adhesive cellulose tape an eco-friendly product. It is a recycled ecological product and a biomass mark product certified by the Japan Organics Recycling Association. It is not plastic. Nichiban self-adhesive cellulose tape was created in 1948 in Japan. It not only introduced the practice of sticking and provided convenience in our lives, but also contributes to sustainable development. The main ingredient of self-adhesive cellulose tape is plants, which absorb CO2 in the process of growth. As a result, the amount of its CO2 emission is one-seventh that of petroleum-based plastic tape after incineration. The total length of self-adhesive cellulose tape used is enough to lap the earth 4,500 times. The tape is reeled by a winding core, cut to a certain width, inspected, and boxed, making it ready to sell. Shipped off to the world from Japan for sticking and connecting, it contributes to making our society more sustainable. <laughs>